Now this is part two because I was cut off on part one. And I'm gonna keep this video as short as possible here. Your, your mind, your mind is phenomenal. Your mind is something that you need to explore. Your mind is a gift to you. Your creator has given you a resource that you can tap into. You could revolutionize your life. You could revolutionize experiences. We just went on a little trip. But I want you to think about what I talked about in that little trip. Imagine your life with or full of courage. Imagine your life with an uncanny belief in yourself that when you wake up in the morning, you look in the mirror and you say, whatever I set my mind to, I know for a fact that I can accomplish it. That's the kind of mindset, that's the kind of leadership, that's the kind of visualization, the, the imagination that we must learn to live with and practice every single day. Childlike imagination. Now I talked, I got ended on that video and I talked about imagine if you practice this little scenario that I, this little trip that I was kind of putting us both into in this video. Imagine if you practice that now, I'm not talking about doing it. Of course, it, you want to practice doing it. But imagine if you would imagine that on a daily basis. You begin, you took five minutes, ten minutes out every single day or every other day. In my case, every day. And you just thought about those possibilities, the endless possibilities of what your life would be like. How would you learn to respond to situations and not react? How would you be speaking to yourself on the highest positive note possible every single day? Imagine what those imagine what those standards, imagine what those habits, those practices, those rituals, imagine how they would turn your life right side up. Yeah, and you can also think about what people would think, right? What would people, what would your coworkers, what would your family, what would your friends, what would your business partners think of you? How would they think? How, when you meet the very next person that you will meet, maybe for the first time or the last, the first time that will begin a series of more experiences with that person or for the last time, what would that person think of you? They say that first impressions are lasting impressions. And I believe that you are judged like a book by its cover. The way that people judge us is exactly by the way they see us. Probably the very first time. Some I would say that. The, the first time that you have an encounter with somebody, you have an experience with somebody, will, is going to leave you a lasting impression. Now, Santos, what are you talking about here, man? An uncanny belief in myself, courage, vision, imagination, the ability to see in your mind's eye exactly who you want to truly become or what it is that you truly want to overcome. You see, a lot of people are not overcoming because of the simple fact that they're not willing to pay a little bit of a price. I told someone earlier, if you, if you, if you play you pay. That's positive and that's negative. If you want a certain outcome, if you want to receive certain things into your life, if you want to grow, if you want more money, if you want to experience better things, and, and everything is not going to be perfect, I understand that. You have to be willing to do different things. You have to be willing to step out in faith and practice. Remember what I said earlier about, about talking to, to fear? Where you look at fear and you say, yeah, fear... I can smell you. I can hear you. I can see you. But guess what? I'm putting you aside because I have other plans. 
in order to live, in order to build that kind of a scenario, that kind of a lifestyle that I've talked about in these two videos, you must be willing to stand out. You must be willing to step forward and begin acting as if you already have courage. You must begin to step forward and start acting as if you have self-belief. You must begin to go to step forward and begin speaking as if you already have a positive self-talk. Now, come on, Santos, what are you talking about? I'm talking about making a decision to literally revolutionize your life starting today. Yes. Now, I'm not talking about magic here. I'm talking about a decision that's going to alter your life going forward from today on. Now, I'm going to end here because I don't want to make long videos anymore, but I want you to really think about, I want you to really, really and honestly think about what I'm sharing in this video. If you truly want to see some serious and some dynamic and powerful victories in your life, you got to step out in faith. You got number one, you got to make a decision and then you got to, you got to be willing to do what you've not done before. I'm often reminded of Star Trek, going boldly where no man has gone before. But in your case, going boldly where you have not gone before, my friend. Take courage take heart, begin to believe in yourself, unleash that giant. I'm going to end here, but, but think about this for a moment. Visualize. In fact, close your eyes for a moment. Visualize you unleashing the beast, the good beast, the positive beast, the energetic beast, the leadership beast within you. How would that affect you? Where would that affect you? And how would you benefit from that? Man, I'm telling you, life is awesome. <laughs> I, get, I get pumped. I was pumped earlier. I'm going to keep myself low here. I'm going overboard on my time. But I'm telling you, my friend, God has given you a gift. Don't neglect it. Stir it up, my friend. The answers are within you. The power, the resource is within you to make a decision, to make a, a life-altering, a revolutionizing change from today forward. I'll see you on my next video. Comment, subscribe, like, and share my video. Comment, subscribe, like, and share. Don't be bashful. Don't be fearful. Come on, give me some comments. I need your help to help other people. I'm begging you. I need your help to help other people. This video needs to get around. My channel needs to get noticed. So with that said, peace. And remember to make every day a super fantastic, terrific, over-the-top day daily in spite of and because of.